dadgummit, you caught me shaving. Let me wash my face, I'll be right out. I'm Bradley Harder. Glad to be back with you here on Capri Cribs. Let me show you, for the second time around, my home away from home. Sorry you caught me there doing a little bit of shaving, trying to keep this pretty old face nice and tight. I'm a, I got a lot of nice new stuff here on this 2019 Capri Retreat. One of the first things I'm super excited about, got my own tag here, Capri Camper 50 year, 1969 to 2019. Pretty cool deal there. One thing whenever I travel around and we go from one coast to the other, outdoor speakers, you can hear them going now. We spend a lot of time getting ready. We'll hang out out here, let the speakers rock and roll. We do some grilling out here in the morning, sometimes in the evenings. But you can kick your favorite thing on and listen to it. Got my propane tank here. Coolest thing about it, it doubles, is my toolbox. I know we've done this before, but stay tuned because this is the new 2019 new and improved. Way more cool stuff in here than ever, so make sure you pay attention. This is a shower. This is pretty much where I spend most of my afternoon and evenings. As you can tell, I've got some hooks that I've installed up in here. This is aftermarket. I thought of this all by myself. Got a wonderful American hat you can hang up here. Keep all my hats out the way. My towels as you shower, you can hold anything up in there. I've also got this wonderful little cheetah shower curtain. Keeps the water out. This was donated by Wyatt Casper at wyattcasper.com. I use it. See, it swings around here. So if you're in here showering and somebody's in the camper, it gives you a little privacy. I had Capri install some extra clothing rods in here to keep my clothes up out the way. And when you live in here, you come up with all different kinds of scenarios and options. So I use it to hang my hats up in here. Uh, like I said, when you have a great American hat, last thing you want to do is be riding on the floor. So I hang it up in there and these showers, you know, you can get about two weeks out of your 30 gallons if you shower adequately. And uh, I wouldn't own, have one without a shower in it. I could absolutely love it. So come on in, let's look at the rest of the camper. Welcome to the main cabin. <laughs> this is, I know I say every part's my favorite, but this is where I spend every part of every day in here. The cool thing about this, when I ordered it from Capri, I got to pick what colors I wanted. I went with the weathered cedar which I love, as you can see, it comes with the gray cushions and I think it matches great. The coolest thing about this camper, the new table, it's a lagoon style table and it maneuvers all the way around. So anywhere I want it to go, whoever I have set in here, it moves around. You can adjust the height, different variations, and it also folds down into a table here. So I can put this pad down and I have additional sleeping area here. But that's not enough when we're rodeoing. So I had a bunk installed up here, just like before. But the coolest thing, this bunk, it comes down and you got your little tiger blanket up here. When you ride bucking horses, you want to ride everything. Ride you a tiger. You got a window right here and it's got a fire escape. It'll open up if you're ever worried about fire escape. I'm not, but I... I like the shades. We keep it as dark as we can in here, but uh, you can open that up and look outside. And the cool thing is in the morning you wake up, fold it right back up, two seconds back to the table, back to the grind. So uh, once again, the king's lair. This is where I, s if I'm not driving when we're rodeoing, I'm up in here. If you look up here, USB power port, you know, when I go to bed, I have my phone plugged in. It can charge. I can watch Netflix, check everything I need to. Got my light power source here. You have lights up here in the nose and a plug in, 110 plug in. Another cool thing that you're not going to see when you look at the King's Lair up here, it looks normal, but it's not. Five more inches in the 50th anniversary edition. So this is a 60 inch overhang. And when you say five inches, that's not much. You go ask Emmett Smith how important five inches is. I was just laying up there thinking five inches isn't much. And then I got to thinking, I bet when they run for a touchdown and they're five inches short, five inches means a lot. <laughs> Around the corner here is my entertainment center, which the cool thing about it, 
It has my switches that control the surround sound in here, which makes this thing boom like a theater when you're watching TV or listening to the radio. It controls my outdoor speakers. I have a CD player up there with Bluetooth on it and a Blu-ray DVD player that's connected to my TV. So it's all hidden around the corner where I can control it over there and it's up out of the way. My TV's mounted on the wall here and it, it can move around anywhere I want it, any way I want to put it on there. I had Capri install an Xbox on here and this has been a lifesaver for us. You know, we have a lot of downtime, a lot of dead time. So we can jump back here, play Madden. Woo! <laughs> Take that, you cut it, and any muggins! <laughs> and if I open it up here, you'll see the coolest thing. It has special holder back there for all my controllers, my remotes. I like to have my drinks cold, my food cold. And this has been the best refrigerator that I've ever had. So if I open it up in here, it, 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 again, it's linked to my battery, so I don't even have to be plugged in for it to keep everything cool. So you got your brown rice, granola bars, my bottle of Cristal, as always. Y'all are in luck because there's usually a box of Cristal. See, I've got a microwave up here. Now this is a lifesaver. This is the flush mount sink. And again, my wife and I truly adore brushing our teeth at least twice a day. And this makes it possible. See, you pop it up hot water cold water whatever so we can brush our teeth flop it back down back to counter space so we've looked at the sink we've looked all around the camper now here's one of the things i'm most proud of we're custom built by hand in texas since 1969 three of 50 so they're only making 50 and this is number three which i'm proud of so you better get your order in today and make sure and get you one of these 50th editions i love it i'm bradley harder You've seen my crib, I hope you liked it. Now I've got Bronx to ride and cattle to drive, so get the heck out of here.